वेलकम टू माय चैनल आर एल डी अकाडमी दिस इज लेक्चर नंबर टेन ऑन टू पोर्ट्स नेटवर्क इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस ऑन सॉल्यूशन ऑफ टी पैरामीटर्स प्रॉब्लम यूजिंग कैस्केट कनेक्शन प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ टू पोर्ट्स नेटवर्क सो इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी हैव डिस्कस्ड द कैस्केट कनेक्शन प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ टू पोर्ट नेटवर्क and that we are going to use it and we want to solve one problem now this is the problem look at here so this t network problem we had solved in last to last class and we got t parameters or abcd parameters using equation okay we have expressed v1 i1 in terms of v2 i2 then we have got the t parameters problem now today i want to get the solution of this one using cascading property right so its solution we obtained this one the t would be this 3 11 1 4 now now let us see uh, how to get this t parameters for this t net to work without writing any equation you just using this property of cascading so this cascading connection of two port networks so here the network a for that it is ta network b it is tb then total t network for this one we can write by this property as right so this one would be t equals to or t equivalent i can say ta multiplication with tb so you should keep the same order so first ta then tb right so if it is more than uh, two parameter two networks so if there are n networks then we can extend this property as so the first one is t1 then t2 then t3 all are multiplication form up to tn if there are n such two port networks are connected connected in cascade cascading one after another then equivalent t to work would be just multiplication of all those t parameters okay right and furthermore so in previous lectures uh, we have considered on two port single element two port network right so can you discuss that one yes so the first one is this one okay this is your v1 this is your v2 this is r and this is i1 this is i2 and for this the t parameter we have obtained very easily okay how is that so the gain reverse voltage gain reverse current gain both are unity and here the input impedance is zero and here admittance would be 1 upon r that we have discussed in previous lectures so if you have some confusion please go through that one i don't want to repeat it again okay and if it is this one so this type of single network this is your r this is your v1 i1 v2 and i2 and for that t parameters are very simple again similar 1 1 this is 0 and resistance is r that's all okay so be careful about this one what i am saying so if if you have a resistance here 
for that you will get its admittance 1 upon r and if it's impedance here then here you will get impedance r this is 0 and these two both will remain 1 1 both the cases okay so if we use this one along with this cascading property we can solve many complicated t network problems or t parameters problems right let us see now i want to get the same result this t parameter for this t network using cascading property okay so what you will do we will use this one this is suppose one small network okay and next network is suppose this one a single element network and next one is suppose this one so these three different networks they are cascaded we can think okay then what would be your equivalent t so your t parameters so first of all this one for this network you see what i have said that this matrix first of all this is one this is one and as it is, it is in three resistance 2 ohm so 2 will be here and there is no admittance it is 0 right and for the next one this one okay what we will do we will consider this matrix this is 1 this is 1 and this one is 0 and this 1 upon r 1 upon 1 is 1 ohm so this is also 1 ohm okay so that 1 is for this one this resistance 1 upon r so 1 by 1 is 1 right next one for the 3 ohm series resistance this is 1 this is 1 this is 3 this is 0 <coughs> now we can simplify you can multiply so first you can multiply these two so any two first you can go for first two also it's fine so what you will get so i will keep this one as it is one two zero one and this product so this is one into one and zero into zero this one into one is one zero into zero is zero so one plus zero is one right then one into three into 1 into 0 so 3 plus 0 is 3 again right and then this 1 into 1 1 into 0 then 1 plus 0 is 1 then it is this one is 1 into 3 and 1 into 1 so 3 plus 1 is 4 then multiply these two so what you will get so you will see this 1 and this is 2 1 plus 2 is 3 the next this one is 1 into 3 and 2 into 4 8 3 plus 8 is 11 yes and then 0 plus 1 is 1 this 0 plus 4 is 4 so have you got the same result this one and this one it's exactly same so you see without writing any equation we can find the t parameters of a complicated network so if it contains more than three element also we can find equivalent t in this way right i think you have got this concept now i'll give you first uh, one homework problem few homework problems then i'll discuss what would be the next video I, in the next video what i am going to discuss so we'll be discussing this one right now so this is the homework problem this three i hope you can find out easily now so check your understanding if you have got this concept can you find the t parameters for this three one two and 
three networks. Okay, I hope it is simple. Can you try? So, so if you get the result, then post your answer in the comment section. I will reply. And in the upcoming video, look at the problem. This figure contains one dependent source, the current dependent current source. So this is the circuit. And can you solve this problem? Can you find T parameters for this problem? And moreover, can you use cascading property of two port network to solve this problem? That's the interesting problem, interesting question. Okay, that we'll address in the next video. So keep watching my videos. And if you like my video, then subscribe my channel it's a free subscription and to subscribe my channel first you press the subscription button and then again you press the bell button because then only you will get immediate notification for my future videos i hope you are going to subscribe my channel if you have not yet subscribed it keep watching my videos I'll be uploading lots of videos in this channel. Thank you.